well. And I had just thought that, you know, my arm, you know, locked up or something. It was just tendonitis. So I tried to work through it. Didn't work and ended up, uh, they took me off the roster. And when they, the day that they took me off the roster, I went home and started that whole process on getting my elbow um, further looked at and ended up having to go to uh, Dr. Andrews in Montgomery, Alabama, uh, or his facility. And they uh, patched it right up. You know, basically what had happened, my the ligament in my elbow was totally fine, but I had a, uh, a piece of bone, probably the size of my thumb or my thumbnail that uh, had been growing in my elbow when I, the surgeon said maybe about since when I was 12 years old. And so uh, since I was 12 years old, this piece of bone that popped off started snowballing and on that on one pitch or in that, in that inning, it pops off my elbow and my ligament was trying to hold it in. And that, you know, back and forth motion, that's why I couldn't feel anything. Um, and I passed all those tests of like, the, you know, the standard, you know, is your UCL. I didn't feel a pop. So um, that was kind of uh, why I thought I just had some elbow issues. And I had been throwing, but it just felt really, really uncomfortable. Come to find out that, you know, the only way to get that piece of bone out is to rip everything out of your elbow and do the old school Tommy John surgery where they pull the the uh, spare tire, as they call it, out of your out of your uh, hamstring. And so because the gap was super big and, and uh, the way to fill those that gap was to take the biggest ligament and it so, uh, comes out of your hamstring. So that was very unfortunate because when I was feeling good, I was throwing well, I was going to you know, be on the uh, Israeli Olympic team. Um, and then it just 